Kennedy and for today's video I'm going to be showing you everything that I've been loving for the month of January and a lot of it is going to be beauty related so hopefully you guys enjoy that but let's get started. So these first three things are all nail polishes and I picked these all up from Winners and the first one is Bearing It All by OPI. It is a gorgeous nude color. I am so pale and I have trouble finding like nice nude nail polishes that I think look good on my skin tone and so I am obsessed with this one. I've been wearing it literally all of the month of January. It is just amazing and in some lights it's cool because it kind of looks grayish and sometimes it looks more nude. I just love this and because I got it from Winners which is like TJ Maxx or TK Maxx it's like reduced. I got it for like $7.99 so it's cheaper than regular priced OPI. It's just just perfect all around. Then I have the Bourjois So Glossy Nail Lacquer in the shade 08 Peach and Love and it is just the cutest peachy pink color. Obsessed with this one and it's supposed to last up to 10 days. I have not worn it for that long because I had it on and I loved it and then I went straight back to bearing it all so didn't give this the fairest shot but when I had it on it was a gorgeous pink color you never have too many pink nail polishes. Literally my motto. I just love them. And the last one is the holy grail product. It's Sesh Beat, the fast drying, yes, dry fast top coat. And I have heard so, so much hype about this for absolutely ages. And then I never wanted to pay full price for it. So I got it a little bit cheaper at Winners and I have seen the light and I have in love with this. It literally dries your nail polish so fast. If you've used it, you know what I'm talking about. If you haven't, I would recommend trying it out. It took me ages to finally try it, but I'm so happy I did because I love painting my nails. They're always painted, but I don't ever like waiting for my nail polish to dry. That is the worst part. I just, I want to do more things. So this makes it so easy and it's just amazing. So I would recommend trying all of these nail polishes, but specifically the top coat because it's wonderful. My next favorite is a perfume and if you've watched my videos for a bit, you've probably heard me mention that I wear the One Direction perfumes, which I still love, but I got this one as a gift this month, so I've been wearing this one every single day, and it is J'adore by Dior. Not only is the bottle super cute and just fun because it just, that's how it opens, but the scent, the important part, is beautiful. It is so feminine and floral and I am the worst at describing scents but off Sephora's website <laughs> told me it is Lang Lang, Damascus Rose and Sambac Jasmine. Sorry that was awful but it is just a beautiful floral scent and it is so it's not too overpowering but it lasts all day like I just spray like one spray from kind of far away and then I put it on all the points that you put perfume on and by the end of the night I could still smell it and it's beautiful. I've gotten compliments on this so if you like floral perfumes maybe you're looking for a new one. I would recommend going to smell this one <laughs> because it is just gorgeous. It is amazing. Just my favorite this month. So so nice. And these last two beauty products I have are both lip products and the first one is what I'm wearing right now. It is the Maybelline Color Elixir in the shade 005 Breathtaking Apricot. It is just a very low commitment product. I just slap it on and blend it out and I'm good to go. I like wearing stuff like this to work because it looks pretty initially but it's not too bright or out there and then when it wears away after a couple hours then it's just your natural lips and it doesn't look like much of a difference. I know that might not sound appealing but it's good and it works for me, so I like this. It is a rediscovery because I've had this for a while, but I just found it in my makeup collection and I figured, why not wear it again? I think I'm anticipating spring with this color, so I don't know. I know I'm gonna pick up some more of the colors too, like the purples are super pretty, so I really have been loving this product during the month of January. And the other lip product I have is the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick in the shade 01 Fiery, Fiery. I don't know how to say any words, I apologize, but it is a gorgeous red color. Can we take a moment to appreciate this red color? Stunning. It lasts for just a few hours, like it's not the most long wearing and I found like if I try and eat or drink with it, it does kind of come off in the center of my lips, but if I'm not going to be eating or drinking for that time period, then this is a amazing product. It is so matte, 
but it feels like nothing on your lips. It does not dry out your lips. I don't understand how this Gypsy Magic works, but it is amazing. And the color range they have is super pretty too, so I'm really contemplating picking up a couple more. It is pricey. I believe it's close to $30. I can't remember exactly, but it is a wonderful lip product. And every time I wear this, I get compliments and people ask me about it. So this has been a winner for the month of January. Hands down, amazing. And now on to the random favorites. This first one is a mug and I picked it up on the same trip as the nail polishes that I showed at the beginning. It is from Winners and it was $5.99. Such a steal for a big mug. It is an owl. They had it in red too, but I just liked the white one. I have an unhealthy obsession with mugs. I've said this before, I will say it again because Mugs are so cute though, so I, it's not a problem that I love mugs, it really isn't. But yep, yeah, it's just a cute owl mug, been using it a lot, it's really all I have to say. So cute, and it serves this purpose, so it's easy, easy favorite. <laughs> then for movie and music favorites, I have no tangible things that I could show you, but I have been loving the movie Into the Woods, and I say that because I may have seen it three times. <laughs> different people each time and it just I mean normally I don't ever see a movie in theaters like more than once unless I absolutely love it so I saw Big Hero 6 twice and that was amazing and I just just different circumstances I saw Into the Woods three times and by the third time I was singing along like not externally I was like melding the words to all the songs so I mean that was fun I like it if you don't like musicals then you probably wouldn't like it, but it's fun. Disney, the cast is great. Good, good movie overall, really. It's just great. Then for music, I have just been jamming to Lips Are Moving by Megan Trainer, as everyone else is, and also Uptown Funk. Like, <laughs> those songs are just my jams right now. I just, I, like, I love Christmas music. I've said it before, so I've been trying to wean myself off and except that Christmas is over. So I've been listening to just all these like pump up jams and those have been the ones that I've been turning to. They're just so fun. It just makes me have a dance party every time I turn them on, but that's always fun, right? Who doesn't love a dance party? And my last favorite is a clothing item and it is this long sleeve shirt from Victoria's Secret Pink. It is super casual and easy to throw on. It is this really pretty like blue color. It kind of looks like indigo purplish on camera, but it's just super pretty and it has these black stripes on the sleeves here and it has this patch up here. I don't know how to describe it. It's just like a different material just at the top. Like if I showed you the inside, you'll see that there's a difference. And so there's that. I just love these shirts. I have, I think maroon and white different ones, but like these thinner kind of shirts that are so easy to throw on and they're good for just wearing around the house and wearing out because they're super comfy and cute. And I just, I'm obsessed with Victoria's Secret Pink. Nothing else to say, really. So those are all the things that I've been loving for the month of January. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Well, you probably already know that I love Lush. If you don't and you're new here, hi, I love Lush. There we go, I'm glad we got that out in the open.